And then I met my current boyfriend and it's been, it's been fabulous. Uh, and here's the thing about being in a relationship though. Apparently like, whatever, pulling out doesn't work is what I hear, even though it worked the first 30 years of my life uh, and I'm only 32. I might be off 10 years, sorry, my math is not that good. Uh, but yeah, we had to start using birth control. Ugh, and not condoms, because I haven't used that since I was 12 either. Um, no, I take pills, but I don't like to call it birth control. I refer to it as border patrol, all right? Stay with me, people, don't, don't leave me now. Uh, I picture these tiny little soldiers at the end of my uterus with little machine guns, they're adorable, <laughs> fighting off these intruders, right? But like a good Cuban, I have a wet sperm, dry sperm policy. So if one gets through, it's all right. All right, that's what's happening there. Oh my God, Cubans arrepentido, who didn't get it. All right, <laughs> stay with me. But I have plan B, by the way. Plan B is, ironically enough, when you hear the name of it, if the whole comedy thing doesn't work out or the cruise line thing doesn't work out, I'm gonna be an entrepreneur. Don't ask me how to spell that because I have no idea unless there's a Word document open with a little squiggly line <laughs> to tell me how to fix it. No idea, there's a lot of R's and E's and U's, I don't get it. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna open up my own business. And, it is, and please don't hate me for this, but some of you might be my best customers that drop it like it's hot abortion clinic. <laughs> it, gets, it gets better. Uh, I'm gonna open it up next to a daycare center with a sign that says, don't make the same mistake twice. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.